Hey everybody, it's Aubrey here, and today let's talk about Micromod. Micromod is SparkFun's modular hardware ecosystem that allows you to swap out processors with specific functional carrier boards so that your project build can move as quickly as your ideas. However, Micromod is only as good as however many options it provides. The more variety in options, the more places your project can go. And as of now, with eight carrier boards and six processor boards, you have 48 different ways to build a project. In the beginning of a project, you might want something that's easy to use and economical, like the SAMD51. But as you get towards the end of your project and you have refined your code to pure perfection and it is ultimately optimized, you might want an equally as fast and powerful processor. Well, lucky for you, we've just added the McLaren Speedtail of processors to our ever-growing list. Welcome, Teensy, to the Micromod family. This board is fast and powerful, and diehard Teensy fans can start building out their projects through Micromod. So, let's take a closer look at this super slick board. The new Micromod Teensy processor board is wicked fast and powerful, and leverages the computing power of the NXP IMXRT 1062 chip. It's equipped with an ARM Cortex M7 processor with clock speeds up to 600 megahertz, and it has eight megabits flash memory and 1024K of RAM memory. It also has a plethora of interface options, including three serial ports with one dedicated to USB and two to serial UART, two SBI, two I2C buses, one CAN bus, one I2S digital audio, USB host capabilities, one SDIO for SD, two dedicated analog pins with up to 14 available for use, and two dedicated PWM pins with up to 22 available for use. Plus, what makes a Micromod board a Micromod board, it comes in a form factor equipped to connect via M.2, which allows it to be inserted into any of our other carrier boards. Teensy is already ideal for audio. The I2S digital audio protocol can deal with the relentless stream of serial data that's associated with high quality audio. It's also ideal for intensive data processing. The chip of a Teensy actually uses direct memory access or DMA to speed up processing times for algorithms that require fast processing in use cases with LEDs, movement tracking, or audio. And it works well with sensors that output a large amount of data with fast refresh rates. Basically, Teensy is used in a wide array of vastly different projects, which makes its usage within Micromod so great. You can choose how you want to enhance Teensy, whether that's fast processing with the input and display carrier board or sound recognition with the machine learning carrier board. Plus, you can still use it all through the Arduino IDE and with Arduino libraries. So let's give it a try. Let's test out sound recognition and connect the Teensy up to the machine learning board, which comes with two MEMS microphones. Using an extendable machine learning tool set for the Teensy audio library called Easy Listening, we can detect gestures on surfaces or train it to detect other audio. And what if we actually wanted to visualize those sound waves made from different gestures on surfaces? I could swap out the machine learning board for the data logging board and save the sound file to an SD card. From there, I can import the sound files in a Jupyter Notebooks and graph it out and see what the waves actually look like. I mean, we could even take it a step farther and swap out the Teensy from the data logging carrier board to the input and display carrier board and show the sound wave on the display itself. The options are limitless. Micromod has always been advantageous because it enables prototyping and rapid development. But with the addition of Teensy, the ecosystem is really solidified as a place where you can build anything. Almost any processor you could ever dream of wanting to use is enabled through the ecosystem. So you could jump from the ESP32 over to the RP2040, to the Teensy, and even back to the ESP32 if needed. Basically, your hardware doesn't limit your project, 
only your imagination does. So make sure to round out your Micromod ecosystem at home and pick up the brand new Micromod Teensy processor board at sparkfun.com today. And of course, happy hacking. In the beginning of a prod, in the beginning, the i s digital audio protocol makes it easy to do things. Okay, again, take two. Make sure to do a better job, Avra. We're gonna talk really slowly about this. Take three.